Hi, this is Jay with FreebieBizWorld.com. Thank you all for visiting this particular video. Today we're talking about Jing, and Jing is a tool that will allow you to record uh, what, you've, what you've got displayed on your screen. So you can record video, and then also you can do screen captures. So you can do a uh, still image capture as well if you've got that displayed on your screen. Um, I found out about Jing probably five or six months ago and just was initially amazed at the quality of this particular tool. Um, how you can get to it is if you go to Google, uh, type in TechSmith. Um, you'll see I've got TechSmith there in the Google search bar. So if you just click on the first result, um, it'll bring you to the TechSmith suite. So Jing is a part of, uh, is a part of TechSmith. So you'll just click on Jing there and then it'll bring you to the Jing Project homepage. Um, you'll see here that you've got your download links right on the right hand side so uh, if you're using a Windows system or a Mac system Jing should work for both of those. Um, you'll also see here that they've got a free version and a paid version. Um, up here on the right hand side you'll just see that the paid version costs $14.95 per year. Um, what I'm using for this for this video is actually the, uh, the Jing Pro version. Um, you know, $14.95 per year was almost a no-brainer. Once you see the differences between the um, between the different versions, so uh, what I'll do is I'll just quickly click on the uh, the free version here, and then you'll see that it does the uh, the screen capture. So it it will do a, a capture of an image of a still image that you've got, and then you can also do editing of that. So. Um, it's got the text overlay on this particular image there, so um, and you can see that it allows for for the editing there on the left hand side. Um, and then just quickly scroll down here. It does allow for uh, for the video recording as well. So um, let me scroll up, and then we'll get into Jing Pro. Um, I just quickly just wanted to click on the differences between the two. So here's a comparison tool and you'll see that uh, it's got the free version and Jing Pro $14.95 per year for Jing Pro and what both of the tools do is they, they both do screen capture and editing. Um, you'll see here that Jing Pro allows for five minutes worth of screen recording. Um, that's all they allow for is five minutes. So if you're going to do um, recordings, it's going to have to be organized and pretty short and sweet and to the point. Um, I particularly like that function there where it does not allow me to go uh, longer than five minutes for, for some recordings as it does allow me to, uh, to stay more, more focused in, in what I'm going to say. Um, if you do need more than five minutes, you may want to take a look at some of the other uh, free screen capture tools that we've got uh, listed on the site. So you'll see here as well that both accounts allow for uploading to screencast.com. Um, it's a free account and they give you two gigabytes worth of, uh, of storage area there. So basically what you're doing is uh, you're uploading your videos to Screencast where they house your, your videos on their server. So you don't have to save your videos to, uh, to your computer where um, it might bog down your, your computer and, um, and, and slow it down at all. So I particularly like that. Once, once you get it uploaded, you can house those, um, those files there until you're ready to, to do something with them. Um, you'll see here that they've got, uh, with the free version, you can download in w, an SWF uh, format. And then with the, with the pro version, they've got SWF. In addition, they've got the MPEG-4 video. Um, with, the, uh, with the paid version, you've got unbranded videos. And basically, um, if you use the free version, when you've recorded your video, uh, Jing is, is going to display a logo. Uh, at the top of, of that particular video. So uh, with Jing Pro you will not get um, get that, that uh, logo overlay there. Um, with the Pro version you can share instantly uh, to YouTube and, and some other sites uh, like Facebook um, and Viddler. Um, and then with the, with the Pro you can also do recording with a webcam. So um, you know, those are the differences between the two tools. So just play around with it, um, have some fun, and uh, we'll see you in the next video.